Good evening, I'm Natalie Shepard. And I'm Karen Swenson. Tonight, St. Charles Parish President Larry Cochran is recovering from serious injuries sustained in a motorcycle crash Tuesday night. Now, according to sheriff's deputies, Cochran was a passenger on the bike. His daughter was the driver, and they crashed near his home on Oaklawn Drive. Paul Murphy is following the story and joins us from St. Rose with the details on that. Paul? Natalie, Karen, this is the Oak Ridge, Oak Lawn Ridge subdivision in St. Rose where the accident happened not far from Larry Cochran's home here. And tonight Cochran is saying that something as simple as teaching your daughter how to ride a motorcycle can go from excitement to tragedy in an instance. Fresh divots in the front yard of this home in the 100 block of Oaklawn Ridge Drive mark the spot where Larry Cochran's motorcycle crashed Tuesday night shortly after 730. The St. Charles Parish president, who was a passenger on the bike, was teaching his 19-year-old daughter Madison how to drive the motorcycle when the accident occurred just up the street from his house. According to the accident report obtained by Eyewitness News, his daughter, who was the driver, mistakenly accelerated and quickly lost control of the motorcycle. The report also stated that she ran off the roadway and after she crossed a driveway, the bike shook side to side, then laid to its side, ejecting both her and her passenger. Cochran and his daughter were not wearing helmets. St. Charles residents called the accident unfortunate. I wish that they would have had their helmets on because it's no different than if you were riding a bicycle. He's good for the parish and um, I just wish that he would have uh, exercised a little wisdom. Cochran said in a brief statement, regardless of how simple a short ride in front of my home may seem, it was my responsibility to insist helmets be worn, a lesson I am fortunate enough to talk about today. Cochran's daughter had minor injuries, but the parish president sustained serious injuries to his right leg from his knee to his ankle and his shoulder. Cochran also had trouble breathing. Cochran said while he recovers from a few broken bones and bruises, his chief administrative officer, Billy Raymond, will handle the day-to-day -day operations for St. Charles Parish. Neighbors are wishing the Cochran's a speedy recovery. Well, he's a good man and we definitely, you know, will pray for him. This afternoon, St. Charles Parish Council Chairman Dick Gibbs released a statement saying, on behalf of our council, we offer prayers for our parish president and a speedy recovery. Meanwhile, the operations and business of the parish is in very capable hands. The people of the parish will not see any interruptions of day-to-day -day activities. We have a strong administration with experience to handle this unfortunate setback. And tonight, Larry Cochran remains in the intensive care unit at an undisclosed hospital. We're live in St. Rose, Paul Murphy, Eyewitness News. Of course, we wish him a, and we wish him a speedy recovery. Paul, thank you very much.